Okay, so I'm going to tell you how to wash a quilt. It's very, um, it's an old method. Uh, it's a, it's a tried and true, and you have to follow each step specifically, specially. Do not waver from this method of washing a quilt. Okay. So first of all, you're going to want a front loader washer. I mean, ideally there are many other ways you could go about this, but this is, this is a good one. Okay. So you need a front loading washer, um, just because the, the gentle sort of agitation of the front loader washer, you know, it's, it could be easier on a quilt rather than like the spinny spindle spindle thing. This is all, you know, it's just what I heard. This is what I heard. Um, and so front loader washer. Okay. And then, and say if you don't have one of those, we actually have one here at this apartment where we're staying, but at the spots in uh, Chicago, we have a laundry room in our building. We don't have front loader washers. So we only have the spindle kind. So um, if that's the case with you, go to a laundromat, find a laundromat that has those front loader washers, um, get some uh, good soft detergent, like gentle detergent, like Woolite or Draft or Orvis paste makes a really good one. Um, my mom used to use Orvis paste. I remember that. And then, so get your detergent, get some quarters, right, for the laundromat, and then um, get your quilt, and then also get an old sheet or an old towel, something that you won't, you won't mind getting dirty, okay? Just something like from the garage or whatever, if you have a garage. <laughs> Who has a garage? Um, so, so you get all that stuff and then you go to the laundromat, okay? And then you, you put the detergent in to the machine and you put your quilt in to the machine uh, and you put your quarters in to the machine and take that towel or that sheet, whatever you brought, and fold it nicely and put it at the base of the machine. And then right after you press start on the machine, you get down on your knees and you pray. You just get down on your knees on that little pad that you made for yourself and just pray to God that nothing happens. Yeah. It's a little joke. It's a little joke. It's funny because it's true. Um, that used to be my big closer. With all my lectures, I'd be like, and now I'm going to tell you how to wash a quilt. It, it killed him. Killed him every time. I don't know how it's working right now because I can't see you. But yeah, anyway, how to wash a quilt. There's some good stuff in there, uh, including the praying part. Okay, I have to wash that quilt. I spilled marshmallow sauce on it long ago. It's, it needs to be washed. 